I thought I'd bring you back to where it all started. Twelve years and seven months ago. Here it is. And as they say, all good things must come to pass. Afternoon all. Well, the time has come. The day has arrived. This is my last official day as a full-time teacher. Twelve and a half years. I came here November the 1st, 2010. And, as they say, everybody's time comes. And my time has come. To be honest, I thought I'd be living here in a wooden box, but all going well, I won't. And I'll see the day out and walk out or, or ride out on the beast. Just wanted to say to all the people that have helped me since I came here. And I was green when I came here. You think teachings Teaching a bit of English is easy. Nah. Teaching English and being a teacher are two different things. And that's what I've learned. When I first came here, <laughs> can't really put it in words, but I'll give you an example. My first ever class, I went into Proton 1, Grade 1. And when I met the teacher who I was meant to be helping, or so I thought, she informed me that no, I was the teacher, she'd come to help me. It turns out the teacher whose class it was was sick. Well anyway, I thought I can do this. So I started chatting away, writing a few things on the board, referencing the book. Then after about 20 minutes, the teacher came up to me and said, the students haven't got their books open. <laughs> but we got this sorted. <laughs> well anyway, in the 12 and a half years I've been here, my god, I've had some fun. Teaching isn't work, teaching is a vocation. And it called me, because I don't know if I did say, um, when I first came here I was just a volunteer. I, I'd left the UK and I, I just needed something to do and for a friend I met the head of the nursery which is where I'm sat. Um, unfortunately I can't show you anything child protection laws but hey they are what they are. Well anyway I did a bit of volunteering four or five months did a couple of online studies and then they offered me a full-time job and in that time, since then, I've progressed, and now I think I'm not half bad at it. And hopefully, all the students that have passed through my hands, which I'm not sure are capable hands or what, but hopefully, I've left you with some memories. Because that's what they say: life's about moments. Create, remembering the moments, creating memories. And from my point of view, I've got some brilliant memories. All the staff here, all the teachers, all the students, past, present. <laughs> it's been joy. Right. It's been days, obviously, I didn't want to come, but hey, we're all human. <laughs> but I've loved every minute of it. And as I said, it's my time to go on. And hopefully, not hopefully, and give back to the people of this beautiful country. Because in my time here so far, I've received nothing but love, joy, kindness and help. And people have given to me. And now it's my time to move on and give back. So, hopefully, watch my channel and find out what I'm up to. Okay, cheers for now, and thank you Dallas and Luke.
Thank you. You'll always be in my heart.